So traditionally, starting spiritual conversations is difficult. And it's not that we don't care about our friends. It's more like, what do I say or how do I say it? So a bunch of us from multiple organizations got together to really look at the question of how do we make starting spiritual conversations easy? So when we got to talking, we were really underwhelmed with the current opportunities out there for people to share. Sure, there's social media and there's apps, but there's some major problems there. For example, Facebook, it has my friends, but it doesn't have the content. Say with YouTube, it has the content, but it doesn't have my friends. And then I look at something like Snapchat or Instagram, and yes, that's all about me, but it's not easy to put what I believe on those platforms. So to solve this problem, we wanted to blend the impact of great content with the simplicity of chat and put that in one place that's personal. To craft an easy way for people to start spiritual conversations with the people that matter to them and even get some help in the art of conversation if they need it. So our strength begins in listening to our audience, what they want to do and the barriers they face in starting spiritual conversations. Solving those challenges with an app is a difficult task, and that's why we reached out to some partner organizations like One Hope and I Am Second to solve this problem. So over the last two years, we've worked through multiple design hurdles on a drive to simplicity. Going backwards and forwards with a lead designer on every detail has been tedious, but so necessary, and our drive to an app that truly connect friends that matter and conversations that matter. So we took the ideas that we developed back to our audience and tested our progress along the way. Turning a beautiful design into a working app isn't easy. So we had a global team of developers working on that, from Canada, India, El Salvador, the US, and even New Zealand. And many of these people have just been volunteers. So the product of all of these efforts is an app called Voke. Voke is video sharing that kickstarts spiritual conversations. The key to Voke's usability comes in its simplicity. Sharing what matters shouldn't be hard, it should be easy, authentic, and rewarding. There's a lot of innovation in both, like knowing when your friend plays the video you shared so that you can chat with them in the moment of impact. And that means that we get to be present when God's at work in our friend's life. We all have people in our lives that we care about and we wanna have spiritual conversations with. And Vogue makes that possible in a natural way that doesn't jeopardize those relationships. So now, no matter where you are, you can impact the people who matter most to you. And that's an awesome thing.